uh, first exercise with uh, single cylinder you have single cylinder so you will have one port and one exhaust there are, and inside there will be spring which will help the piston to come back then for single cylinder we will use direction control valve now for example here direction control valve is a push button now what is the name of this valve we can tell it by the circuit diagram so what is the diagram you see two rooms two rooms means two positions and how many ports do you see one two three three ports so the valve name will be three by two direction control valve so this is used for single cylinder so this name will be like three by two direction control valve with push button so when you push it will activate so push button now for the connections you have one and two okay three is exhaust one is always input it is from the source you supply the compressed air it is from the compressor so here our one is connected to the distributor this is distributor you can connect many components through this and this distributor is connected to FRL or air service unit what is FRL F is filter R is pressure regulator and L is lubrication for lubrication so FRL connected to distributor and distributor connected to one so always whenever you see one you connect it to distributor for any valve like you have so many valves here whenever you see one you directly connect it to distributor wherever it is and the even numbers like two four six eight so on they will be output so they are output one is input and three and five odd numbers will be whole numbers will be exhaust or one is always input so here we used push button DCV three by two DCV with push button now we'll change it with another uh, direction control valve both of them are same but the operator is different here we have selector switch so 3 by 2 direction control valve with selector switch now we'll change it how it will work we'll see again direction control valve with selector switch so the operator changes function will be same but the operator changed so based on the purpose or application you will change the valves whatever uh, function or application you are looking for so both the direction both of them are direction control valve if you look from outside they look same but if you go in detail look at the circuit diagram you will see the difference so what's the difference here one is directly connected to two without any operation here you have to operate the valve to make it connected from one to two so what will happen if you use this valve so this valve it has two rooms and three ports so three by two direction control valve with push button but the difference will be here it is normally open this one is normally closed so one is not connected to two so we say normally closed and this one one is directly connected to two so normally open so what will happen if you open the you see the piston moves automatically so when you press the button piston will come back so it is opposite so it is normally open so one is supplied to two it will work immediately and once you cut off it will retract